It is the worst tournament we've ever been to. It is what it is. Oh! Welcome Sunshine Nation! Come and meet my family and spread sunshine and love with us. Here we go! You're assigned to labor in the Fiji Suva mission. <laughs> All right, Sunshine Nation, so we at the Moskowitz tournament today, both girls and boys. It's in Lakeland, Florida. Super excited about what's happening today. Mariah and Jordan on the mat again. Let's go check it out. one match from Jordan. I know. Was it worth it? It was well worth it. <laughs> Loved it. Five hours to wrestle that match. How do you feel? Know? We're good. Ready to go eat. And go to sleep. Yeah. That was a long day. Yeah. They still have it on here that I didn't win. Yeah, but I did. Mariah, when she wrestled her match, they gave her two seconds and said, oh, you're going right now. They didn't tell her she was on deck. They, they just announced and said, oh, 112 is wrestling right now. Oh yeah, you're first, go on. We were here for five hours and Jordan wrestled one time. All right, Sunshine Nation, this is what happened. Before wrestling tournaments, they do something called a skin check and basically they make sure that you don't have any contagious diseases on your body and if you have something then they will normally let you weigh in onto the scale or ask if you have a doctor's note and when you weigh in they can send you to go get a doctor's note and if you don't get a doctor's note then they don't let you wrestle. In this case I passed the skin check for day one of the tournament. I got skin checked twice that day because the guy never marked me the first time. And then I came back on Saturday and went through the skin checks again and I passed again. And then when I went to go step on the scale, one of the coaches from the hosting team pointed at my neck and said, what is that? And um, the ref that was, he said, who checked this? Who checked him? And um, there's a little mark on my neck and the ref who was standing there said, oh, I checked him. And he said, go get the, go get the head ref. So he went and got the head ref. The head ref came back and said, oh yeah, you can't weigh in, step to the side. So they're they asking me, oh, do you have a doctor's note for that? And I said, no, I don't have a doctor's note. So I said, can I go get my coach? I went and got my coach and my coach was asking them, could I weigh in still and go get a doctor's note real quick? And they're like, nope, no weighing in allowed. He can't weigh in. He's not, he's not, we're not gonna let him do that. So it's, it's up to the ref to decide if he's gonna let him weigh in and bring back a doctor's note or if he's just not gonna allow them to weigh in at all. So, that's what happened. They didn't let me weigh in, and um, they didn't let me wrestle. So I, I passed all the skin checks, but 
I didn't wrestle the second day because they would not let me weigh in. The person that was seated second at the tournament was from the hosting school. So it was his coach that pointed it out on my neck after I'd already gone through the skin check with the referees. So another funny thing is they didn't have a trainer or any medical kind of person there that could supersede the ref. And uh, they wouldn't allow me to go see somebody that would supersede the ref. So I just had a, a referee say that I couldn't wrestle and declare that I had something on my neck. Um, but it is what it is. So on to the next tournament. Congratulations to my teammates for both for both getting to the Constellation Finals. Mikey took third and Texas took fourth. So congratulations to you guys. On to the next tournament. Let's go. So just like that, he was skin cleared and now he can't wrestle. Tournament of one, we know this.